Now, see this example. There is a graph between distance and time. Here, time is given in seconds, distance is given in meters. If I ask you to calculate a speed between third and fourth second. So, now you have to calculate distance between first distance between third and fourth second. So, we can take this example just I have drawn this line and this line. See this is a time interval this is a distance this we can take b and this we can take c. We can write a b is equal to 4 minus 3 is equal to 1 second b c is equal to we can write 20 minus 15 meter is equal to that is 5 meter. So, now we can write speed is equal to 15 5 divided by 1 meter that is second is equal to 5 meter per second. This we can say B C upon A B which is equal to slope of distance time graph. Now, see here whatever time interval you take every time you will be getting a speed is constant. Suppose if I take another example calculate speed between 0 and 5 seconds. So, a speed between 0 to 5 seconds how can we calculate see 0 to 5 second total time interval is 5 seconds total distance is 25 meter. So, we can write speed is equal to 25 upon 5 that can be said average speed also 25 that is 5 meter per second. So, whatever time interval you take in this example you will be getting speed remains constant. So, for uniform motion graph is a straight line and speed remain constant. Now, if you want to calculate acceleration from this. So, what is acceleration? Acceleration A is equal to you can write change in velocity that we can write V minus U divided by T 2 minus T 1. So, final and initial speed will remain same throughout the motion time interval changing. So, you will be getting here 0 upon T 2 minus T 1 is equal to 0 meter per second square. So, acceleration for this uniform motion is 0.